Good afternoon and welcome to WRMG TV 12 and also Television 97's coverage of Red Bay Tiger fast pitch softball against the Winston County Yellow Jackets. Hello everybody, I'm Jack Ivey live and I am in Double Springs, Alabama for the Tigers today in Winston County. Honored to have you on the broadcast here today. If you're out there joining us, please share this broadcast. We're hoping to have a lot of folks watching not only from back in Red Bay but also down in Double Springs, Alabama. And, of course, the officials a little bit late. One of them a little bit late getting here, so we're starting a little bit late. But that, that worked out really pretty good because we had a, uh, a couple of uh, maybe a family or two from Red Bay uh, showing up about five minutes late, and I just told them that I held the game up so they could uh, uh, be able to see the game here today So and not miss a play. So so if you all believe that, uh, that I held it up, I promise you I'm not, I'm not – I am telling the story, okay? We're live on WRMG TV 12 and also Television 97 to with the Ivy Broadcasting Company. We got some wonderful sponsors that, of course, are making this game possible today. We got our lineups. It's going to be hard to hold on to our lineups because uh, the wind blowing a lot. But uh, we're hoping that uh, we'll be able to uh, make it through this game. And uh, of course, Winston County is on a big high after knocking off the ball club last night. Uh, and the Haleville Lions, and I think that was a big, big win for Winston County then. I don't think they'd beat uh, Haleville in a while, but uh, they got the win last night, and we're about ready to get this game underway. I don't know exactly what they're going to do, uh, starting lineup-wise, or uh, what they're going to do uh, as far as the national anthem, but I'm sure some of that will be taking place here in a minute. And a big shout-out to uh, Happy Hollow Outdoors back in Red Bay, and, of course, Community Spirit Bank bringing the hits for you. Big shout out to uh, Johnny's Four Wheelers and Moores, a military family owned business. You and Variety is on a broadcast today, along with the Medical Clinic of Red Bay, Dr. Raynard Fabianchi. And also making the game possible today is, of course, our friends at Alpha Insurance, and also Dr. Fabianchi is on a broadcast here today. Folks in the concession here. Uh, Telling the folks uh, out on the field, the umps there, the, hey, if you get thirsty, we'll have you something to drink. I'm putting on my little cover here, and it's a little tight. And uh, it's a little screen that uh, helps me be able to see just a little bit better. As you see, the Red Bay Tigers, of course, going to be batting first. On the mound, pitching going to be Cummings for the ball club from Winston County. Red Bay's going to be pitching today um, Journey Swan. So, uh Madison Cummins will uh, be a senior. She'll be, uh, of course, wearing number four today. They didn't, I don't think they have the positions uh, listed for me here. Uh, Chaz Garrison will bat second. Uh, looks like uh, Marley Stewart, uh, Libby Harper, A.J. Sutherland. You got Ella Kennedy, uh, Kaylee Cobb, Lizzie Bass. Uh, looks like Riley Williamson and also Macy Blevins. Uh, freshman will be the catcher on the ball club for today. I told you the wind is blowing. It's picked up a little bit. <coughs> it's going to be perfect weather for the ball game here today. We just uh, want to pray for the internet. Hopefully it's going to hold up good. And once again, this is WRMG TV, we're TV 97. We're shooting through a fence rather than a net, so we'll have to deal with that. If you'll just look right through that fence and look at uh, Cummings, the pitcher out there, and Young, the batter, we're ready to go. And here's the pitch to start the game. It's low. And this is uh, McKenna Young for the Red Bay Tigers. She is the shortstop, got a sister that plays over at first base. Today, of course, uh, Hannah Butler will bat second, Jasmine Pearson and Emma Blackburn, if anybody gets on in that cleanup slot. There's a ball hit right back to the pitcher, the throw down to first in time for the out. And that'll be the first out of the inning. Tell you what, on these uh, sunshiny days, hard to see that old uh, through the viewfinder there very good. But dude, like I say, it's an honor to do the game for you here today. This is WRMG TV 12 and also Television 97. McKenna Young grounds back to the pitcher, and here's Hannah Butler, batter number two for the Red Bay Tigers. Big shout out to Community Spirit Bank. They're bringing the hits plus sponsor in the game today. 
And the pitch on the way. Swing and foul back right at me. One ball, one strike. Like I said, they did not uh, put the positions down. But I can tell you, number 12, Libby Harper, is behind the plate catching. And she is a senior. A.J. Sutherland, wherever she's out on the field, she's only an eighth grader. Blevins uh, doing the catching is a freshman. Pitch pretty but a little bit outside. Two balls and a strike. One out. Hannah Butler. Boy, she pitched a great game down at Red Bay the other day with Winston County in town. Journey Swan closed that one out as the Tigers had a big win over Winston County. Folks, I can't see the viewfinder. I may not do as good a job as I'd like on uh, zooming to a particular spot. Live coverage here from WRMG TV 12 and TV 97. Live in Double Springs, Alabama, Winston County. It's Red Bay and the ball club from Winston County High School, the Yellow Jackets. Got my son Kyle on the phone. Kyle, I'm broadcasting here and running the camera as well. And uh, I'll call you back a little bit later on the way home. But uh, we appreciate uh, the world famous Kyle Ivey checking in with us today. That's my son who lives in uh, Munster, Indiana. He's a chaplain in the Air Force. And the Tigers get their first hit with Butler and a runner on at first base with one out and here's some speed at the plate good ball player here and this is Pearson and the pitch on the way swing and a foul back Madison Cummins on the mound the senior Red Bay with their blue tops and Got the orange t-shirts underneath. Got their orange leggings today. Gray pants. No balls in one strike and one out. Thanks for joining us. Please share a broadcast wherever you're at today. Swing and a pop-up. That one should be caught by the shortstop, and it is. So the runner will have to stay at first. Now there will be two out as Jasmine got in under that one. And this will bring up Emma Blackburn. The catcher for the Red Bay Tigers. Do me a favor. If you've not shared it, uh, I'm going to ask you about a dozen times during the game to share the broadcast. And uh, <clears throat> we need a lot of folks watching. Uh, several Tiger fans made it, but I know a lot of folks couldn't make it. Pretty good little trip down to Winston County High School. Cummins on the mound. She's got to signal, and she'll bring it to Blackburn. Blackburn looks at a ball high. Red Bay Tigers, of course, uh, Michaela Young is the flex player over at first base, and there's a foul back. Second baseman for the Tigers is Kyla Blackman. Over at third base uh, for the Red Bay Tigers today, they've got Gracie Edgman. Your shortstop is McKenna Young. Out in the outfield, left fielder is Michaela Jackson. Your center fielder today is Jasmine Pearson. And over in right field for the Tigers today is Lexi Howard. And there's a pitch swing and a miss. One ball, two strikes. On a windy day, you can probably hear the wind whipping in my microphone. And folks, there's nothing I can do about it. But you enjoy the broadcast, and uh, we'll do the best we can with the weather conditions we've got, it could be raining, but, and it's not. It's beautiful. A little cloudy sun peeping through every now and then. And a swing and a miss. Emma really reached out for that one there and swings and strikes out. And Hannah Butler will be on the side as a stranded player. We're live on WRMG TV 12 and TV 97. Let me uh, <clears throat> tell you some more of our sponsors here in just a minute. They include, of course, Pro Concert, Mr. Terry Hayes down in Tupelo, Mississippi. Brandon Nunley Construction. Terry Hayes, of course, does all your church sound systems at Pro Concert. Automated camera systems, streaming setups, a full line of musical instruments. Brandon Nunley Construction, 256-412-6500. Also, Triple H Electronics. David, of course, and the crew. Uh, Go Tigers from Abby, Macy, and Layton. 
Also, Pro Finish is Highway 25 South in Belmont, 256-224-8447. Ricky McGee, free estimates, your RV Collision Center. <coughs> Don't forget Happy Hollow Outdoors has got a large variety of firearms and ammunition. We'll be glad to even build you a rifle. Come see the staff at Happy Hollow for all your outdoor needs. 985 9th Street West, Red Bay, Alabama. Also, big shout out today to Thompson Gas, home of the Rely Propane Meter. Of course, no more tank rent, no more fees, no more large propane bills. You only pay for what you use, not like in the old days. Or if you put a 100-gallon in, depending on how much it was, two, two guy, 200 gallons, you had to pay for it. And even in the off-season, your tank might have 100 gallons in it, and you may have 200 $250 tied up in gas during the season you're not using it. That won't happen. It'll be on them. Thompson Gas Company, 256-356-2194. Also, don't forget the Cardinal Drive-In on our broadcast. Uh, of course, the Cardinal open every day with the exception of Sunday, 356-2358. Also, Bliss Aesthetics is on a broadcast. And Bliss Aesthetics, uh, that's Beverly Winchester Green, a licensed esthetician on First Street Southwest in Red Bay, specializing in sugar hair removal, individualized skin care, facials. Bliss Aesthetics, of course, 256-460-9547. Also, tonight's broadcast brought to you by Casey Lott, your attorney specializing in personal injury and also product liability cases, 662-554-4000. H.W. Watson Logging Company, Kevin and Harold, they buy your timber and timberland, 256-810-8141. And also big shout out to Swamp John's Restaurant and Catering on the broadcast, 356-2300. Once again, fish day, of course, on Thursday, chicken on the stick on Friday. And this is... The first pitch call strike. This is Cummins. Madison, her dad's coaching down at first base. Big shout out to the Banner Tire Store, Mr. Jason Parker down on the Fairview Banner Road, 676-2177. Always wonderful prices on tires and fixing flats. They also can fill your propane bottles as well. 5H Farms, Donovan, Haley, Hudson, and Harper. And of course, Ellis Wooten at Brick Driven Realty in North Alabama real estate specialist and he is good folks buying selling you need to call us as a pitch back to the fence appreciate all you fans from western county and also red bay that's uh, made it out today i told you who's on the mound pitching today there she is her name is journey swan journey swan Two balls and one strike, and the pitch on the way. Switch and a pop to the right side. Right fielder is back. Right fielder not going to be able to get to it. And it is a fair ball. She's on her way to second, on her way to third. And the ball comes in. And a good job of Gracie Edgeman over there to stop that. That ball gets by. She comes on and scores. So Cummins hit that ball down the right field line. It uh, kept carrying. I don't know where the wind's rolling that way or not. Uh, it's blowing, but I'm not sure exactly which direction. I don't see a flag around. I do down outfield, but it's kind of wrapped around. So the wind is blowing in some, looks like. So that might have affected on which way that ball went. Chas Garrison batting right now. And a swing and a miss. These players walking around here eating those dill pickles. And Chas' dad, I think, brought some. And Chas was tearing up those dill pickles as some of the other folks here as well one strike nobody out a runner at third base and the pitch swing and a slow roller that's going to go to the shortstop the throw to first not going to be in time and a run is going to cross the plate Cummins crosses the plate and it is a one nothing Winston County ball game and the runner safely at first base so Garrison is safe this will bring up Marley Stewart Marley Stewart will be the batter. So one nothing to score. Showing the bunt. Runner stealing, and she is going to be safe in at second base. I was putting the score up. I'm by myself today, so I didn't zoom in on that steal, and I apologize, but I was fixing my scoreboard right here. So I'm having to run the computer and the camera plus talk plus doing the sponsors.
but that's okay. Appreciate Gary and Cody Armstrong. 256-810-4596. Those your backhoe work. Clean up jobs. And there's a shot to left field. That ball is over the left fielder's head. McKayla Jackson have to run it down. And Garrison on the way to the plate to score. And the ball comes back in. And that young lady is down at second base with a double. Boy, they're coming out and hitting the Red Bay Tigers early. Lead 2-0. Still nobody out. Winston County Yellow Jackets and the Red Bay Tigers. All brought to you by some great sponsors. Don't forget uh, Community Spirit Bank bringing the hits for the Tigers today. Thank you, Dr. Brad Gentleman, your family medical, medical doctor at Shows Primary Care. 256 383 And he's married to Red Bay's own Sierra Hubbard. There's a shot to right field. That ball has got trouble all over it, too. And that ball is down. The runner will have to hold up at third as they've hit him where we're not. Took that ball down to right field. Good job there by that last batter there. Marley Stewart. Who we got now? That was Libby Harper, I'm sorry. Libby Harper got that hit. Libby, I think I got her on camera right now. We are going to have a courtesy runner for her. And this is going to bring up number 14, A.J. Sutherland. We do have a courtesy runner at first. I didn't get her number. That may be Taylor down there. Oh, Don't forget we got uh, Tish County and Kossuth uh, baseball today going on over at Kossuth. And here's the pitch. Ball in the dirt. Runner will steal. So it's 2 nothing, bottom of the first inning. One ball, no strikes. Gracie Edgman down at third. McKenna Young at short. Blackburn over at second. And Young over at first. Blackburn is behind the plate. Journey Swan, and there's a pop-up. Blackburn going after it, not going to be able to get to it. That one's out of play. Today's game brought to you by Doc, uh, Run, Ronald Thorne, your State Farm agent for home, auto, personal, whatever you need might be. Come by and see Ronald at his office on the main drag in Red Bay, 356-4459. He's here to help you make things go right. Also, the Neighbors Clinic, Dr. Jim Neighbors, Dr. Stephen Neighbors, nurse practitioner Devin Fancher, 356-9537. And the pitch, swing and a miss, gets away from the catcher. Now the runner's coming, and a dive at the plate, and she is safe. Good hustle there by the young lady coming down the line. And that was number 33 scoring right there. That was uh, Marley Stewart. We can add another point on the board. That'll make it a 3 nothing score. Runner down at third now. One ball, two strike count, and the pitch on the way. Swing and a foul ball. That is 22, the courtesy runner down there. Taylor. Coach Gary Blackman, not a happy camper here early. One ball, two strikes, and the pitch on the way. Swing and a line shot to the shortstop. The throw over to third for the double play. Good job by McKenna Young over to Gracie Edgman. And a double play much needed for the Red Bay Tigers. I can assure you that. Good play, McKenna. Good job, Gracie Edgman. And number two will be your batter now. This is Ella Kennedy. <laughs> And there's a shot to the second baseman. The throw over the first in time for the out. And after Gary got after him a little bit, I think uh, they played better. Sometimes you got to get your attention, I guess, right? Once again, this is WRMG TV 12 and also Television 97. I'm Jack Ivey live. And once again, we've got live coverage here 
on your hometown station. We're going to change it over to the second inning as the Tigers will bat in the second. If you're out there joining us on the broadcast, we appreciate all of our wonderful sponsors, of course, that make the games possible each and every week. I'm trying to find my trying to find my old cursor here. And when you can't see, it it doesn't matter. We're going to change that to the second inning. And now we'll tell you about some more of our great sponsors. 3 0, second inning. It's the Red Bay Tigers trailing Weston County. Today's game brought to you by Allen and Ash Harden and Harden Heating and Cooling, your official York dealer. Over 48 years, three generations strong. Thank you. Harden Heating and Cooling. Also, big shout out today to the Red Bay Pharmacy building, Donna Weatherford, located on the Golden Road, 356 4044. We're families in health care, helping families who need health care. We are Red Bay Pharmacy. And about Red Bay Reynolds, Mr. Johnny Weatherford uh, loves to store your treasures for you. And he may have a unit or two available right now if you'll check with him. 256-668-0039. There's a reason that everybody trusts Red Bay Reynolds with all your storage. And that is Johnny Weatherford himself. He's a very good guy there. 256-668-0039. Also, Shannon Oliver, a Franklin County Sheriff. Making the game possible today. Sunshine Homes, builders of quality homes since about 1971. And also, don't forget the city of Red Bay, mayor and the council. Of course, the mayor just had a birthday. And there's the pitch, swinging a foul back. This is the second baseman for the Red Bay Tigers batting here. You know who that is, don't you? That is Kyla Blackburn. And the pitch on the way. Swing and right back up the middle. Second baseman's got it. Throws to first. They say she's out. And a close play over there. And Blackburn goes down over there. Hopefully she is going to be okay. So Kyle Blackburn is the injured player for the Red Bay Tigers. I don't think that I got that on the instant replay, but I might show it to you. We'll show you the tail end of that one. She went across, and I didn't really get it in time to uh, get it for you. We're live on WRMG TV 12 and TV 97. Now I can't see the viewfinder here to take it off the uh, replay, so bear with me, folks. You may have to look at that replay for a second. Let me turn my camera back around. And there's a foul fly ball in the left field. That ball is curving. Foul. Hey, do you care to hold that for a second? Thank you. I can't see my... Well. Y'all bear with me, folks. You're missing the action, and I apologize. Good play, I think, defensively for the ball club from Winston County. Still a 3-0 ball game. And that'll be the second out. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. I couldn't find my mouse. Folks, there is two outs. And let's see who who's batting here for the Red Bay Tigers. Coming still on the mound. She's got a top of the second 3 nothing lead over the Red Bay Tigers. This is number 12, Howard. Lexi, the right fielder for the Tigers. And the switch and a foul back and out of play.
find my roster back here. Journey Swan is just got out in Kyle Blackburn while I was trying to get my computer back going. I might have to leave that along. Because I can't see the viewfinder enough to switch it back to where it's supposed to be. So hopefully Blackburn's going to be okay. They have rolled an ankle going over the base down there. Nobody on for the Tigers and a 1-2 pitch to Howard. And swings, slow roller, third baseman's got it. Long throw and it's in time for the out. Now Howard takes a spill down there as well. But she is okay. She kind of tripped over the bag or whatever and she's okay. So the Red Bay Tigers trail by a score of 3-0. We're in the bottom of the second inning. Only one game on tap for you today. Brought to you by Franklin County Pope Judge Barry Moore. Don't forget, it's election day uh, for the runoffs. Not too much talk on it. It was kind of on us, and, and most people, oh, I didn't know there was a runoff today. But uh, So if, if you hadn't voted yet, you got till 7 o'clock tonight to get out and vote in Franklin County, Alabama. Thank you, Sunshine Homes, Builders of Quality Homes since 1971. The City of Red Bay, the Mayor Council, also your hometown Piggly Wiggly and Ace Hardware on our broadcast here today. Also, don't forget uh, Redmond Heating and Cooling with Patrick Brooks, 279-6569. Residential and commercial install, service and repairs, free estimates on new installs. He's state certified, licensed, bonded. It's Redmond Heating and Cooling, Patrick Brooks, 279-6569. Also, Redmond Pharmacy, J.C. Weeks, 356-9000. Also, your state senator, Dr. Larry Stutz. Good luck to Red Bay and all the other area teams. Working hard for you every day is the goal for State Senator Larry Stutz. Also, Stadium Pros, Keith Kennedy, Alton, Barksdale. Community Spirit Bank, of course, making the hits possible today and also uh, sponsoring the game as well. Banking Solutions since 1908. Fastway Car Wash out on Highway 19, Miss Ann Vincent. Of course, she's located right beside Johnny's Four Wheelers and Moors. I had an opportunity to be out there on behalf of Johnny's Four Wheelers and Moore and Bobcat uh, today and got a chance to meet uh, some of the uh, upper management folks, uh, one of them being Gabrielle and Peter. And uh, they ran uh, checking on uh, Johnny's Four Wheelers and Moors and talking about how great a job they are doing for Bobcat in Red Bay, Alabama. So if you're in the market for a Bobcat mower, uh, not a Bobcat mower, a uh, Bobcat tractor. You can put all kinds of attachments on it, and they got some zero financing for 84 months right now. You need to check out the financing. 1-0 pitch, and the foul back. This is uh, Kaylee Cobb. Lizzie Bass is on deck. Jack Ivy live. Hope you're enjoying the broadcast. I ain't even had a chance to even check my cell phone to see how we look. And the pitch on the way. Change is outside. Two balls, one strike. Appreciate all these uh, great folks at Double Springs, Alabama being so nice to us as always. Wind blowing in right now, right in my face, and there's a the ball high. 3-1. Tigers don't need to be giving up any free base runners. They got them in trouble in the first inning. Some uh, great hitting where the Tigers were not by Winston County. And the pitch on the way. Swing and a pop-up foul back over me, but out of play. I've never seen a uh, score operators eat as much food in my life. You know, they're keeping the score, they're playing the music. And uh, you can't imagine what they've ate today. And the pitch on the way. And there is a shot into the outfield. That ball is in there for hit. Jasmine unable to get to that one. And we got a base runner down at first base. I'm Jack Ivey live for WRMG TV 12 and TV 97. Somebody trying to call me, folks. I cannot answer the phone if I'm live on the air, if you know what I mean. So we apologize. That was nobody important there. It was Sirius XM for some reason trying to call me. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, 
If you're watching a broadcast now. Thank all you folks that are watching us just checking out my broadcast. Looks pretty good. Got to deal with the fence, but that's everywhere. Got a runner stealing the throw down there. She's safe. So 3-0, runner at second with nobody out. Appreciate uh, Fastway Car Wash, Miss Ann Vincent, right next to Johnny's four-wheelers. Red Bay Hospital, thank you, Miss Sherry Jolly, Sue Helms. The world-famous Mike Robinson, Chris Austin, and all the support staff. They got her going on at the Red Bay Hospital, no doubt. 3-5-6-95-32. If you'd like to be a sponsor of the playoffs, don't forget the Red Bay games Friday from Vernon will be on the NFHS Network. Remember, they won't let us do Facebook in the postseason, but we can be on the NFHS Network, and that is what we'll be doing this Friday. A doubleheader, Red Bay Baseball against uh, Vernon. And a bunt, and she backs it up. It's a ball. I noticed about that long. How many How many y'all get? Four Twixes, those big ones, my goodness. Are y'all pooling your money together and buying all this? And the pitch. And there's a foul ball. Where'd you get all this money at? Huh? Your mom give it to you? And you're being nice helping your friends buy out stuff? Do I? Oh, okay. She's the baby. Sharing with friends, that's pretty awesome. Two balls, two strikes, one out, a runner at second for Winston County. They're already up 3 nothing in the pitch. Swing and a miss. As number one, Lizzie Bass is down on strikes. I believe this is uh, Riley Williams. It's going to be your batter. She'll bat with one out. Appreciate your Edward Jones agent, Mike Jones. I'll get around to it someday. Hopefully, that's not your savings for retirement strategy. Mike Jones been doing it in Tishomingo, Edelman, and Franklin County for over 21 years. 256-332-7924. With all the uncertainty, folks, you want to make sure that the person you trust is somebody like Mike Jones. One ball and no strikes. And the pitch on the way. Swing and a miss. We're in the bottom of the second inning, live in Double Springs, Alabama. Beautiful facility here at the school. And the pitch on the way. And the ball, the runner stealing. The third base, third base when Gracie Edgeman was playing in, so when she caught it, she was still away, a good ways away from the bag. And uh, kind of an easy steal right there if you're Winston County. Journey Swan, the right-hander on the mound. Two balls, one strike, the pitch on the way. Laying a bunt down, foul ball. Two balls, two strikes. On your scoreboard there, unless something's happened that I don't know about. It's I can't see it from where I'm at. Three to nothing, Winston County. And the pitch on the way. Low in the dirt. And the throw down to third. She is safely back in. That's a good order. Internet's holding up good, so. Send us a message to let me know you're watching and who you're pulling for out there. I'll get a chance to look at it here in a little while. Three-two pitch, one out, and the pitch on the way, swing and a miss, and it tipped it. She tipped it. Blackburn couldn't hold on to it. 
Coach Cummins down at third, yelling out encouragement. Three balls, two strikes, one out, pitch on the way from Journey. Foul ball off to the right. Don't forget on the broadcast today is Tiffin Motorhomes along with Tiffin Supply, Tiffin Appliance Company. Triple D's Hardware and Lumber over in Iuka by Tri-State Insurance right there in Red Bay. Ground ball right back to the pitcher. Throws to first out. Runner has to stay at third. Good job of the Tigers to hold her at third. So they do get their second out. And this will bring up number four back to the top of the batting order. This is Madison Cummins. 356 4804 is the number for Tri State. And of course, we're talking about Miss Brenda Purser right there in Red Bay. Of course, Tri State in Belmont as well. Over in Booville. Wonderful folks at Tri State. Thank you, Bear Health and Wellness. Go Tigers from Kayla Humphreys and the staff. 256 376 2036. Bay Diesel and Air Conditioning, Chris and Valerie Marr, your authorized Freightliner RV dealer by Silver Dollar Bargains in Golden and Tupelo. Also, Casey Johnston, our school board member, on our broadcast here today. And Mr. Greg Hamill, our superintendent. Thank you, Miss Casey. She represents district number five, Thunderflow. That's Michael Funderburg. Check him out on Facebook and TikTok, 662-262-3569. And the pitch, swing and a shot to right field. That ball is curving foul by a good bit. <laughs> Kaylee Cobb has to return down to third base. Thank you, Red Bay Gas and Water. Don't forget to call before you dig. That number 356-8622, but you need to call 811. And also a big shout out to Bay Tree Gift Company, Beverly Winchester Green. She's right next to WRMG. 2-1. Tell us how our broadcast is looking. I can't I can't uh, watch it from where I'm at because I'm busy broadcasting, talking about our wonderful sponsors, broadcasting the game, and also running the computer as well. So you let me know what it looks like and sounds like out on Facebook and YouTube. If you're on YouTube, Stay on YouTube, but pick that phone up and come to my Facebook page and and share our Facebook page to your Facebook folks, even though you're watching on YouTube, and then say, Jack Ivy, it looks good or bad or what? 3-1 count, and that's over but low, and Cummings draws a walk. You know where she's heading on the first pitch. Chaz. Garrison will be your batter. Live coverage here from WRMG brought to you by Happy Hollow Outdoors. Items for pets, women, boutique clothing, interior items. You can get a bravery registry or bridal registry. You can also get Luke Alexander, LA7 gear. Of course, Luke, former player for the Belmont Cardinals and the Mississippi State Bulldogs. And his new gear of all types of from uniforms, bringing in shoes, he's got your hoodies, he's got your uniform tops, working on cleats, a lot of new items. His name is Luke Alexander, LA7. His number was seven, LA stands for Luke Alexander. That's available, by the way, at Happy Hollow. There's a foul ball down the third base side. There's where all the food is being cons consumed. That's where all the food is being consumed. Tell them how many Twix y'all have had. We had four Twix. Four Twix. A nacho, four peanuts, two pickles. <laughs> and there's a shot to left field. Left fielder not going to be able to get to this over Jackson's head. One run is in. Two runs are in. And she is down at second base as that ball went over Jackson's head in the left field. And that'll make it a five to nothing ball game. Good job there by Garrison on that hit. We're live on WRMG five to nothing. Winston County leading 
over the Red Bay Tigers. Appreciate BNC Dirt Work, David Corm, and of course Chris Blackman. Chris here at the game today. His daughter Emma back behind the plate there catching. And the pitch on the way. Over the low. Got a runner stealing, and she is safe. Slid under the tag. Driveways, uh, covered installs, gravel parking lots, clearing land, building pads for houses, hauling gravel, dirt. You uh, give them a call. They will answer, and they will show up and do the work. 5 nothing, and right back up the middle. Base hit will drive in another run. And number 33 that time. Got that nice hit. That is Marley Stewart getting the hit. Good job, Marley. It is now six to nothing. Six to nothing. Winston County leading. Today's game, of course, let me give you the number for David Corm, 256-668-5660. 256-460-7805 is Chris Blackman. Also, Dossett, Big Four, and Chipolo. We highly recommend them. And here's the pitch. Runner stealing the throw down there, and she is safe. So Stewart getting the stolen base down there. Dossett Big Four is a block away from the hospital. They won a lot of national honors and sales and service. They want you to be leaving a satisfied customer. Always get more at Dossett Big Four, 628 South Gloucester in Chippewa. There's a pop-up. Third baseman, Gracie Edgman, over to make the catch. Good job of Gracie to retire the side. A lot of damage. Three runs in the first and now three runs in the second. We're going to go to the third inning. It is all Winston County. They lead 6-0 over the Red Bay Tigers. Of course, today's game uh, brought to you by some really, really great sponsors, including Happy Jacks, Tire and Lou, third generation family owned and operated automotive service business located at 823 Kennedy Street in Red Bay. Call us for all your tire mechanical work. 256-284-0414. We're live right now in Double Springs, Alabama on this, the Ivy Broadcasting Company. We're updating our scoreboard right here to go to the third inning. Thank you for being out there with us. Like I said, I ain't had a chance to check my Facebook page. His comments will go back to the mail. But if you are watching and... I want you to send me a little message and say the broadcast looks good or bad or whatever. We're broadcasting Tish County and also um, Kasuth later this afternoon. Charlotte uh, Guntz, I love watching all these games from Texas. If you didn't broadcast, we wouldn't get to see Coach Long and the Lady Braves play. And that's, uh, of course, some of the folks over at Tishmingo County watching that Tish County game. Once again, we're live on WRMG TV 12 and TV 97. Donna Baggett out there, Erica Wells, uh, Jimmy Arnold with us on our broadcast. Remember, folks, I need to hear from you. Send us a message and let us know you're watching our broadcast. We'll see who's going to bat for the Tigers here in just a minute. Number 11, Michaela Jackson is going to lead it off. Today's game brought to you by Cash and Thermal Plastics. Thank you, Chuck. Franklin Electric, CBNS Bank. Sunshine Meals, makers of the great cat food and dog food. And also Big Star of Red Bay. And a big shout out to Generations, Meg Deaton and her style. And we're just starting the third inning. And a call strike. Gracie Edgman on deck. Big shout out to Community Spirit Bank bringing the hits. And we need some of those hits. Community Spirit Bank right there in Red Bay. A couple of locations, Vina, Russellville, Belmont. And they're open in Fulton, but building a brand new facility. Not for sure exactly when it's going to be finished. Maybe by the end of this year. 6-0. Here's our score. Community Spirit Bank reminds you you can send cash fast with Spirit Pay. Person-to-person -person payments. Here's the 0-2 pitch swing and a miss. She tipped it. 
And also, you can deposit a check from anywhere with mobile check deposits. Send cash fast with Spirit Pay person to person payments. And don't forget, Generations also provides a care in place for those who need a home away from home, even when long term care is necessary for it. We'd rather you get well and go home, but if you need long term care, we can take care of that. Boy, the change by Cummins. Swing and a miss. I heard somebody say it was nasty, and that is probably the correct word, nasty on that one. And the pitch on the way. Swing right back to the pitcher. Cummins has got it over the first. In time for the out. Six to nothing, two outs. Red Bay Tigers trailing, and we're back to the top of the batting order. McKenna Young, and the pitch is low and outside. <laughs> McKenna Young with a one ball, no strike count. And a strike on trying to bunt. Hannah Butler on deck, followed by Jasmine Pearson, Emma Blackburn, Kyla Blackburn, Journey Swan, Lexi Howard, and back around to Michaela Jackson and Gracie Edgman. Today's game brought to you by UN Variety. Don't forget your full-service floors, fresh and silk flowers in Red Bay. 256-356-2288. Two balls in one strike. Hannah Butler is waiting to bat. And the only way she's going to bat is this young lady's got to get on base. Two balls, two strikes, and a swing and a pop-up. That one's going to be foul back now to play. Which way did that ambulance go? Which way did that ambulance go? You didn't hear it? No, it wasn't. Yes, it was. I was looking, hey, I was looking for it myself. And the pitch on the way. Swinging another pop, foul back. is everywhere here in Double Springs today. Two balls, two strikes, two outs. Six nothing, Winston County. McKenna Young better be ready. Here's the pitch, swing. Ground ball, third baseman. Third over to first in time of the out. And you got a bunch of pumped up yellow jackets here in Double Springs today. As they lead, six to nothing as we go to the bottom of the third inning. I'm Jack Ivey live for WRMG TV 12 and also Television 97. Thank you for being with us here today. And once again, an honor to be on the broadcast for you. Don't forget, David Leatherwood's got Tish County and Kossuth going over at Kossuth tonight, him and Matthew Wilson. There's Billy and Janie and Braxton, Bryant and the Payne crew out there. We're looking for our broadcast here live at Winston County. I'm Jack Ivey, live for WRMG TV 12 and also Television 97. Thank you, uh, Patrick Heron, says Let's Go Jackets. Uh, Melissa Stewart out there cheering on Marley Stewart, number 33. Amanda Smith-Blevin says Video Looks Great. 
Go Jackets from Blake Washington out there with us. Uh, Rodney Pinnell out there with us. Jackie Hernandez, Drew Jackson out there checking her broadcast. Georgia Lee, Cindy Buns out there on a broadcast today as well. Remember, uh, you folks, we couldn't do without you. And I know we got, uh, got Yellow Jacket fans out there cheering us on today. We've also got uh, Tiger fans out there. Just make sure you share this broadcast and that'll make us happy. Once again, we're live on WRMG TV 12 and also television 97. Hey, Lola Kay, Colton Harrison out there, Ginger Whitehead Cole, Corey Scott, Richard and Darlene Shook, Trey Johnson, Sarah Scott, Diane Wigginton, uh, Ricky Long, uh, Phyllis McCann Wolven out there, Janice Collum, Keith Grimes, Helen Offries, Billy Pfeiffer, Judith Adams with us out there today, Patrick Heron, once again, Amanda Blevins. Thank all y'all for being on our broadcast here on WRMG. Swing and number 14 gets a hold of that one and that ball is down for a hit. She's going to turn it on and end up down at second and is she out at second or safe? She is safe. She stirred up a lot of dust and slid in there safely. Great job there. Number two will be the batter now. Folks, that was A.J. Sutherland and she's only an eighth grader. Got a hold of that one. A.J. Southern. So here we go with nobody out of runner at second. Winston County. Ground ball to the third baseman. Bobbles it. And everybody is going to be safe. So the Tigers. I promise you, uh, Winston County does not need any help. Kaylee Cobb, the batter now, as Ella Kennedy is safely on base. Let's go, Callie. Callie Cobb. Runner stealing without a throw. Thank you, Johnny's Four Wheelers and More. You're, of course, dealer for Argo, Bad Boy, Big Horn, and, of course, Bobcat in town today. County Clipper, Coolster, Dixie Chopper, Massimo Motor, Spartan, they got you zero turn mowers, side by sides, adult kid, four wheelers, pontoon boats, golf carts. And there's a shot out into left field. Left fielder there makes a catch. The runner tags up, and she is safely in there. And the runner advances over to third base. So that will make it a, another run on the board for Winston County. And yeah, that'll make it a seven to nothing ball game. I believe this might be Lizzie Bass. And she bunts, perfect bunt. Nobody's gonna throw her out. And her other one's gonna score easily. Now Bass gonna head down to second, safely down there. So her speed, not only the bunt, but her speed being able to get down the line not only drove in another run, but she's able to take second base without a throw. Folks, it's 8 nothing here at the bottom of the third, Winston County, who lost to Red Bay at Red Bay. There's a bunt. That one's perfect position, too. Nobody's going to get that one. She is safe, and guess who's going to come around to score? Lizzie Bass. So Lizzie Bath quietly from second base on that bunt. Didn't bat an eye, turn third and come home to make it a nine to nothing ball game. Thank you for being with us today. All brought to you by the Medical Clinic of Red Bay, Dr. Raynard Fabianchi, Alpha Insurance, Mr. John Cook, 356-4411. My pro concert, Mr. Terry Hayes, does all your church systems, sound and video. Brandon Nully Construction, 256-412-6500. Runner stealing the base, throw down there. It's going to go in the outfield. She'll stay there. This is number four, Madison Cummings. Or Cummings, I should say. I don't know why I call her Cummings. Madison Cummings. 
Nine to nothing. Here's the pitch on the way. This young lady's pitching today, doing a great job. There's only one out. And the pitch. It's a ball. Appreciate Triple H Electronics. David Humphreys and the crew there. You got Abby and Macy and Layton. Pro finishes, Highway 25 South, specializing in RV repair, detail, new collision repair. That's uh, Ricky McGee, Highway 25 South in Belmont, your RV collision center. And there's a pitch high. Throw down there, the runner stealing, and she's safe. Got in under the slide. Tiger fans not pleased with that call there. Nine to nothing. Winston County leading the Swan pitch. Ball four. And now the throw as a still another base. What's her name? Uh, Cummings never stopped at first. She took off down to second, and that runner there took off to third. And they got another runner over there easy. Don't forget uh, Happy Holla Outdoors on our broadcast here today. Located in 985 Ninth Street West. All of those side-by-sides and four-wheelers pop up. Where's it at? I don't even know where it's at. Center fielder brings that ball back in. Everybody's going to tag up. And now she is out at third base. She got off base a little bit, and uh, this time the ump called her out. That will be the third out of the inning. So Cummins gets caught off the bag over at third. And she'll head back to the mound. But guess what? Ten runs are on the board. They got three in the first, three in the second, and four in the third inning. So that last run will count. So we're going to go to the fourth inning on WRMG. Of course, we got state playoff games coming up this weekend. And if you go by Randall Lindsay, Randall's thinking we may not be broadcasting any ball games this weekend because of rain, but you got to be prepared. Whether it's going to rain or not, be ready to go. So that's what we're going to do. We'll be ready for the Tigers in Lamar County. That'll be on the NFHS Network. Go to the NFHSnetwork.com and subscribe so you can watch Red Bay. I believe it's like maybe 10.95, but it's good for a whole month. So you could technically watch all the playoffs for one price. You just make sure you put down Red Bay as being your home team. Appreciate the Cardinal Drive-In on the Golden Road, 356-2358. Thank you, Miss Denise. Thank you, Thompson Gas Company, Bliss Aesthetics, Beverly Winchester Green. Casey Lott, your attorney, H.W. Watson by Swamp Johns, the Banner Tire Store, 5H Farms. Ellis Wooten, a brick-driven realtor, your real estate specialist, 256-460-598. Gary and Cody Armstrong. What about Dr. Brad Genevan? Ronald Thorne at State Farm. Neighbors Clinic. What about Red Bay Pharmacy? Allen and Ash Harden and Harden Heating and Cooling. Red Bay Reynolds. Mr. Johnny Weatherford. By Shannon Oliver, your sheriff. By Sunshine Home since 1971. The city of Red Bay. Bigley Weekly and Ace Hardware. Franklin County Probate Judge Barry Moore. Redmont Heating and Cooling. Patrick Brooks. Redmont Pharmacy. J.C. Weeks. State Senator Larry Stutz, Stadium Pros, Keith Kennedy, Alton, Barksdale, Community Spirit Bank, Fastway Car Wash, along with the Red Bay Hospital, the Deaton Funeral Home, your Edward Jones agent, Mike Jones, also on our broadcast today, Tiffin Supply Company, Tiffin Appliance Company, and Tri-State Insurance on our broadcast. Kim and Caleb Wells, Mike Moore, Brenda Purser, and Christy Mayo make up the broadcast team of Tri-State 356-4804 in Red Bay. And the pitch makes it a 2-0 count. Cummins is ready to go. The pitch low, 3-0. This is Hannah Butler. 
Appreciate Bay Health and Wallace, Kayla Humphries, 376 2036. We got a timeout. Thank you, Bay Diesel and Air Conditioning, Chris and Valerie Moore, authorized Freightliner RV dealer, Silver Dollar Bargains and Golden. That number is 75 Red Bay Road in Golden and 5548 Cliff Gookin in Tupelo, Silver Dollar Bargains. Greg Hamilton, thank you. Thank you, Casey Johnston, our school board member. By Funderflow, commercial and residential pressure washing. Michael Funderburg, Red Bay Gas and Water. And the Red Bay Tigers. Have a race runner. Hannah Butler draws that walk. So Jasmine here batting, Jasmine Pearson. Somebody's talking about a double play. It'd be, it's kind of hard to uh, double team, uh, double play this young lady. She's got a lot of speed, and of course Hannah does too. Thank you, Red Bay Gas and Water. Don't forget to call before you dig. Bay Tree Gift Company, Beverly Winchester Green, next to WRMG, the pitch. And the throw down to first. She is safely back in. Ten to nothing. And the pitch on the way. Over but low. Three and oh. That number, by the way, for Bay Tree Gift Company, 256-740-994. Baby registry, bridal registry, a lot of unique jewelry items. A lot of items for the house. Ball four. Tigers got two base runners. Blackburn. Use your batter there. She's power hitter. We got a timeout by Winston County. Thank you. Happy Hollow Outdoors. Carrying a large variety of gifts, seasonal gifts, and even baby gifts. Don't forget B and C Dirt Work. Chris Blackburn and David Corn. Those all you, all you gravel, you dirt, rock. They do just about anything. They'll return your phone call and they are ready to do the job. Even underground utilities, water and power. Chris's number, he's here, 256-460-7805. Also, Dossett Big Four on our broadcast. Also on our broadcast today is Happy Jacks, Tyre and Lou, your third-generation family-owned business. Located at 823 Kennedy Street. All your tires, all your automotive work, new tire rotations. They got deals all the time, so you might want to check them out. And there's a shot to right field. Right fielder coming in. She's not going to be able to get to it. And the Tigers are going to have the bases loaded with nobody out. And Blackburn taking that ball to right field. So good job, Emma. We'll have a courtesy runner or not. Yes, we are going to have a courtesy runner for Emma. And the courtesy runner is going to be number four for Red Bay. Here and our neighbors, Ariana. Thank you, Franklin Electric, CBNS Bank. Cash and Thermal Plastics, told you about Happy Jacks. What about Sunshine Mills, Big Star, Generations of Red Bay. Thank you, Meg Deaton. Community Spirit Bank just brought that hit to you. Don't forget, student checking and savings accounts are available. You can open one for just $1. Community Spirit Bank. 10-0 Winston County, and the Tigers threatening here as Blackburn swings at that one a little bit low. Don't forget to check out Community Spirit Bank on social media. They're on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. And there is a pop to the right side. First baseman's under it makes the catch. Blackburn kind of hobbling back. She turned that ankle earlier. Going across the bag. Hopefully she's going to be okay. And the pitch is high. This is number eight for the Red Bay Tigers. Journey Swan, Lexi Howard, is on deck. 
Tigers with the bases loaded. Yeah. With one out, nearly one ball, one strike count to Journey Swan. And the pitch, swing and a miss. Strike two. Journey might have took that one out of the park if she had hit that one. Needle on, already checking the count. Contact the Community Spirit Banker and get started today. Paying some pretty good rates on CDs, I heard. Most of the rates are short term now, six months, eight months, 12, and a swing and a miss. For the strikeout, second out of the inning. It'll be up to Lexi Howard. Lexi got a grand slam not too long ago. Thank you, you and Variety and Johnny's Four Wheelers and more, your Bobcat dealer. Medical Clinic of Red Bay, Dr. Fabianchi, Alpha Insurance on the broadcast today. Pro Concert, Terry Hayes and Tupelo. Brandon Nunley and also Triple H Electronics and Pro Finishes, Ricky McGee, down in Belmont. We're in the top of the fourth and that ball low. Remember, the bases are loaded. Got that. Uh, yeah, I do have fourth inning. We're in the top of the four. Lexi's ahead in the count. One ball, no strikes. Nice. Looks at that one right down the middle for a strike. Whatever pitch it is, it's 838. One ball, one strike, swing, and a foul ball. Back to the right side. One ball, two strikes, and two outs. There's two outs and the base is loaded and there's a ball, huh? 2-2. Appreciate the folks here at Winston County High School, all you Tiger fans and Yellow Jacket fans. Appreciate you being always nice to us. And the pitch. Swing and a pop-up. First baseman's got it. Third out of the inning. Tigers have the bases loaded. And nobody out and strand all three runners. We're going to the bottom of the fourth. This is Red Bay Fast Pitch Softball live at Winston County on WRMG TV 12 and TV 97. Honored to have you on the broadcast here today. We'll be back with more in just a minute on this year hometown station. Live on WRMG TV 12, TV 97. We're live in Double Springs, Alabama, going to the bottom of the fourth inning. It's all Winston County. They lead 10 0 over the Red Bay Tigers. And the Red Bay Tigers will continue to pitch Journey Swan. And we'll see who's leading it off here. Don't forget to uh, Happy Hollow Outdoors. Check out your next pair of boots, maybe your next cowboy hat. Or if you need fishing stuff, any type of outdoor stuff, they got it for you. And there is a strike call. This is number 33 here. She's had a great day today. Marley Stewart. Marley Stewart. I think some of her family was watching earlier. 
And we do appreciate you watching. That ball foul back. And the pitch on the way. Swing, ground ball, third baseman, foul ball. And the pitch it is a strike call, strike three. So Stewart is out on strikes. This will bring up number 12. Who is number 12? This is uh, Libby Harper, a senior on the ball club. One out in the bottom of the fourth inning. It's all Winston County. They lead 10-0 over the Red Bay Tigers. All brought to you by Thompson Gas Company, the Cardinal Drive-In. A big shout out to Bliss Aesthetics, Beverly Winchester Green, also Casey Lott, your attorney, and H.W. Watson, Kevin and Harold, buys all your timber, timberland. Swing and a fly ball to center field. Center fielder is over. She's under it. Makes the catch. Two outs. This will bring up number 14. A.J. Sutherland, an eighth grader. First pitch is a ball. Journey Swan's ready. The pitch, swing, and off the handle, and nobody's going to be able to run to it. I promise you, Gracie Edgman gave it 1,000%. Thank you, Swamp Johns. Don't forget the fish on Thursday. Well, they're everywhere. I saw where they're going to be in, I think, uh, Double Springs coming up for too long. They're down at Haleville a lot. They're, they're scattered around every Swamp Johns doing those fundraisers. And if you had not had a chance to get out there and get some Swamp Johns fish, you're missing out. Appreciate the Banner Tire Store, of 5-H Farms, Donovan Haley, and Ellis Wooten at Brick Driven Realty, your North Alabama real estate specialist. Ground ball to the third baseman. Throw to first. Too high, and Young can't get it. And guess who's down to second base? Standing up down there. A.J. Sutherland, Ella Kennedy will be the next batter. Is that a gospel song? Oh. Huh? Going to have uh, Hadley Elliott going to be a courtesy runner. She's a seventh grader. So all this music y'all playing in the background of the players, it's all gospel or southern, southern gospel? Where you go to church at? Huh? New Hope something? Oh. 10 nothing Winston County. And the ball inside. Hey, tell me the name of it again. New Hope what? New Hope at Abel. What does that mean? Is it a Baptist church or what? New Hope what? At Abram. Oh, at Mill Abram. And a ball, huh? She goes to New Hope. Where do you go to church at? Somewhere in Haleville. Fall City Baptist. Somewhere in Haleville. I bet she goes to, uh, I, I know where she goes to church in Haleville. And there's a shot foul of Red Bay. New Prospect. You go to New Prospect in Haleville? That's not it. What now? 
They own the church. And the throw to first. Gets away from the catcher. Another first base, another run scores. And that courtesy runner already come around and scores. So we've had a couple of errors in this inning already. And right now it is 11 to nothing. Coach Kerry Blackburn's got to be pulling his hair out down there. If he's got any left after today. This is number six, the batter here, as Ella Kennedy is on. Kaylee Cobb. So Kennedy's down at first. A little pop to the right side. That one's going to be foul. Appreciate Gary and Cody Armstrong does all your doja backhoe work. If you need dirt, move, rocks, tearing down buildings, they got equipment to do every job you can imagine. Gary, you and Cody, you've been with us for a long time. I'm talking about a long time, but we really appreciate it. Gary and Cody Armstrong. And I'll give you that number, 256-810-0596. I don't want to tell you the score, but it's on the screen there, 11 to nothing. If you're a Red Bay Tiger fan, you Winston County folks got to be tickled to death. After Winston County losing down to Red Bay, Winston County coming back. They may be getting a little extra power over knocking off those Haleville Lions last night. 11 to nothing, a pitch on the way. And it's a ball. And the pitch. It's another ball. Three balls, two strikes. Two outs. Bottom of the fourth and a swing and a fly to left field. Left fielder comes over, makes the catch. They will strand a runner. Winston County leads 11-0 as we get ready to go the fifth inning. This ball game moving right along, and right now, all in favor of Winston County Yellow Jackets. Thank you, Dr. Brad Genovan, family medical doctor at Shoals Primary Care. Ronald Thorne State Farm. What about uh, Red Bay Pharmacy? Hard and Heating and Cooling, Red Bay Rentals. Shannon Oliver, Franklin County Sheriff. Sunshine Homes, the city of Red Bay. The Neighbors Clinic, Dr. Jim Neighbors, Dr. Stephen Neighbors, Nurse Practitioner Devin Thatcher, your hometown Piggly Wiggly, and Ace Hardware is on a broadcast here today. Folks, I haven't been able to put any points on the board for your Red Bay Tigers. They are down by a score of 11 to nothing. It's been all Winston County from the first inning. They lead right now on WRMG TV 12 and TV 97. Honored to have you on the broadcast here on your hometown station. Stay with us. Nothing to the score. I'm Jack Ivey, live for WRMG TV 12 and TV 97. Red Bay batting here in the top of the fifth inning. And the pitch shot to right field. That one is in there for a hit from Michaela Jackson.
So Michaela got a base hit to right field. Good job, Michaela. She went with that pitch. Gracie Edgman here will bat. We stranded the bases loaded last inning. Had bases loaded with nobody out. And the pitch on the way. Ball high. Good job there with the catcher. Libby Harper. She's a senior behind the plate. And the pitch. Ball up. Two balls, no strikes. Edgeman batting here with a runner at first. And the pitch on the way. Swing, slow roller. Shortstop bobbles it. The throw over to second for the force out. And the runner safe at first on the fielder's choice. So good job to at least uh, get the leadoff. Uh, not leadoff, but the lead runner out there. This will bring up Michaela Young, brought to you by Sunshine Homes, builders of quality homes since 71. The city of Red Bay, your hometown, Piggly Wiggly, Barry Moore, your probate judge. Redmond Heating and Cooling, Patrick Brooks, Redmond Pharmacy, State Senator Larry Stutz, and also Stadium Pros with Keith Kennedy and Alton Barksdale. Our hits today brought to you by Community Spirit Bank. Don't forget to bank with someone you know, and don't forget to student checking and savings accounts are available. You can open one today for just one dollar. And there's a shot to left field. That one's in the gap. So the Tigers are going to try to get over to third base. If that throws on target, she's out. And they say she's safe. The ball got dropped. She was out the whole way, and uh, they dropped it over at third base. So the Red Bay Tigers have Edgeman safely down at third base. So with one out, second and third, McKenna Young. Hannah Butler's on deck. And the pitch. Slow roller, foul ball. So Hannah Butler. The batter now. Pearson is on deck. And the pitch on the way. Swing right back to the pitcher. She'll look to run her back. Now throws it to first. That'll be the second out of the inning. And this will bring up Jasmine Pearson. We're in the top of the fifth inning. 11 to nothing. Appreciate Deaton Funeral Home, your Edwards own Jay's at Mike Jones. Big shout out to Bay Health and Wellness on our broadcast today. Tiffin Supply, Tiffin Appliance Company. The change is a ball. Appreciate Tri State Insurance, uh, Bay Diesel Air Conditioning, Silver Dollar Bargains, Greg Hamilton. What about Casey Johnson, our school board member? Thunderflow, Red Bay Gas and Water. Baytree Gift Company, thank you, Beverly Winchester Green, Happy All Outdoors, and B&C Dirt Work. Madison Cummins, all the mound pitching, has pitched a heck of a game. She's got an 11-0 lead right here. And the 2-0 pitch, swing and a foul ball. Two balls and one strike. Uh, 
And the pitch on the way. Ball high. And the pitch, ball four. So Jasmine Pearson draws the walk. Tigers got the bases loaded again. Two outs. Appreciate Happy Hollow Outdoors. Told you about BNC Dirt Work. Chris Blackburn and David Cormo give you David's number this time. 256-668-5660. Underground utilities, water or power. Haul your dirt work. Build your pads if you want to build a house or maybe a building. Uh, work on the driveways for you. All you gravel. And here's the pitch on the wing. Change is number 29, Emma Blackburn. Emma can take it deep, I promise you that. Appreciate Dossett Big Four, folks in Chippewa, Mississippi. Happy Jacks, Tyron Lube there in Red Bay. Cash and Thermal Plastic, CBNS Bank, Franklin Electric, Sunshine Mills, Big Star, Generations of Red Bay, Alabama. And don't forget uh, all these wonderful sponsors who have made this game possible today. Community Spirit Bank, thank you for bringing the hits to us as we appreciate you. They do the three-point shots down the first baseline. First baseman bobbles it, gets on the bag, and that is an out. And I believe that is the ball game. 11 to nothing is going to be your final score. The Red Bay Tigers losing to the ball club from Winston County. Once again, your final score, 11 to zero. As Winston County gets the big win today over the Red Bay Tigers. We hope you've enjoyed our broadcast. Make sure you go back and watch it again. Make sure you go back and share the broadcast. And if you do that, I know the... We surely would appreciate it. But once again, we're going to go final here on our screen there. And as soon as we can do that, um, 